Phil Dupree, Executive Vice President of Autobytel, clearly states that third-party leads are an objective and essential way to connect with consumer prospects and the dealer. Well, as you know, I've been in this uh, industry for a long time with AutoNation, AutoUSA for 16 years. Uh, that really, that discussion has probably been an ongoing discussion for many years now. So if, if we would have bought into that, uh, I think we would have said that, that we would have shuttered the lead business five or six years ago. Uh, I think it's important to note that what's really important about the lead business is that quality leads, and again, I make that distinction, leads that where the consumers have, have gone through the buying cycle and they're now ready to connect with dealers. Those kind of leads that I call quality leads aren't going to go away. Consumers still need a way to connect to dealers, and fortunately for uh, an auto tell platform, consumers want to go to an objective website. They want to look at the website and they want to compare brands. Yes, it's important for manufacturers to have their websites because that's where really where you can go deep in a brand. But when a consumer is just shopping, they need to go to an objective third-party site, and that's really where auto tell fits in. So I would tell you that the consumers, as we move through the evolution, I really see the lead business continuing, but maybe the, the contact points might be different. I'll give you an example. Uh, Autobytel, back in September, purchased uh, Advanced Mobile. And with that purchase, it gave the capability to sell text leads. And again, when you're saying leads or third-party leads going to die, maybe the contact will be different. We want to we want to work with consumers in any way that they want to c connect with the dealer. So what we're finding is, again, mobile is becoming a, a, a big, big uh, driver of traffic. Consumers are going to their smartphones. And so text leads are now available through the Auto Tail platform. So if a consumer wants to connect with a dealer via text leads, we're happy to support that connection. So I really think that there will be leads, the old five-liner as we call it, still continues. I mean, there are consumers, and there's a lot of consumers, as you can tell by the press release. There's a lot of consumers that still want to interact in that way, but we also want to support any new way that they want to interact with dealers. So I don't see that going away in the near future. Again, consumers are going to drive that process. If they don't want to send in an email, they can call. If they don't want to call, they can text. So we want to make sure that we support the consumer and the dealer in any way they want to connect.